My name is Dr. Paul Saba. I'm a family physician who practices family medicine in Lachine, Quebec, Canada. I want to appeal to you, Your Majesty, as King of Belgium, not to sign the law extending euthanasia to children. In Canada, they are planning to pass a euthanasia law here in Quebec, where I live. And this will have an impact eventually on our children. If you sign your law, euthanasia will be extended not only to children in your country, but also to the children of the world. What started off with adults is now being extended to children. We cannot allow this to happen. There are millions of children born every year with congenital malformations, including our daughter, Jessica. Jessica was born with a severe cardiac malformation. If she was born in a country where euthanasia is permitted, she could have been euthanized. That was four years ago. Baby dear. Lazy baby dear. Oh. Oh, mommy. Oh. I too, mother. When I first saw Jessica, a few hours after she was born, um, they were about to take her over to the children's and I remember the first thing I told her was, you fight little girl, you fight. And that's exactly what she did and she's been doing that ever since. Hi Angel, hi sweet Angel. At six days, she underwent emergency cardiac interventions to dilate her closed valve and eventually her heart which was only partially formed started to grow. When she was five weeks old she was able to leave the hospital. I'm blessed to be taking her home. We have uh, definitely had difficult times but I thank God for the outcome that she's alive and that she's doing well. She's now four years old has an older brother, John Anthony, and sister, Eliana. Jessica, my little sister, who had heart problems and had to have surgery, is very energetic and is a really great sister. I love Jessica. She makes me laugh. Jessica's the best because she's funny. Jessica's the best because she likes to play with my toys. Jessica's the best because she doesn't snore. Some people may not, may not have the same support and resources as we did, seeing that we have the medical background. They may also give up too early and just accept the euthanasia of the child as being their only solution, when in reality, it is not. For the sake of the children of the world, please do not sign the euthanasia law. Please do not sign the euthanasia law for the sake of the children.